As a critical part of emerging disaggregated network operating systems, MetaSwitch composable network protocols afford network architects and engineers with unprecedented control of their routing infrastructure and the flexibility to choose the control plane components that best suit their requirements. A great example of this innovation is an open API through which network operators can receive streamed, programmatic access to the routing table. This enables granular, policy-based control of the underlying forwarding infrastructure by centralized orchestration and automation engines that augment classic route discovery mechanisms. Not only does this enable customized routing logic, this highly abstracted gRPC-based API is also the foundation by which third-party protocols can be easily added. There are many use cases here, from rerouting elephant flows to avoid ECMP load balancing problems to real-time network analysis through advanced telemetry. This is the simple code for a Python script acting as the gRPC client. It's all that's required to receive and display updates and to add or delete specific routes to the routing table based on custom logic. In this example, we are implementing custom logic to optimize flows within the network that have been deemed important. A critical application with a specific IP address is receiving data flowing through Router 1 and Router 2. If the interface to R2 goes down, the network loses connectivity to the critical application. However, the routing controller connected to R1 gets notified that the route has gone and can choose to push a new route to the critical app over the alternative interface. Let's see it in action. In the top left window, you can see a small application displaying what's being received over the API, the current set of routes in the routing table, and what routes the script itself is adding and deleting to that routing table. When we disable the interface on R2, the BGP protocol withdraws the route from R1, and this information is streamed to the route control logic over the routing information base API. It reacts by pushing an explicit route over the API to R1 using Interface 3. You can see the client using its own predetermined logic to react to this change. 